Hey everybody, how you doing out there? It is the one and only Mr. Bookman, and I will be reading All Through the Night by Polly Fever and illustrated by Harriet Hobday. Please enjoy. All Through the Night. It's getting dark. I've had my, my dinner. I brushed my teeth and put on my PJs. But my mom's just had her breakfast. She brushed her hair and it's putting on her coat. While dad cleans up, mom blows a kiss and waves goodbye. She gets an important job to do. Or she got an important job to do. Lots of people work at night. Sammy cleans offices. It's easier to clean when nobody else is there. Every day people make footprints. Every night Sammy mops them away. George is in the same building, keeping it safe at night. He watches his camera screens and checks every floor. Once there was a trapped bird on the night floor, it's lucky that George and Sammy were there to let it free. Hassan and um, Minna keep people safe at night. They wait in their police cars ready to go anywhere they are needed. Tonight they were called because there was a noise in the street. Asana and Am Minna discovered that some garbage cans were knocked over by a family of foxes. Kaisa is a news reporter. She and her team reports on everything that happened during the day and what's going on at night all over the world. They keep working through the night so people will know all the important news when they wake up. Learn plays their saxophone in a band. People gather at night to listen and dance to the music. Eve sells groceries, donuts, and coffee, as well as gas. Her store never closes. Eve keeps people in their vehicles moving when they need to get somewhere. People like... Reba who makes deliveries at night when the roads are quiet 
so he does not get stuck in traffic jams. He unloads groceries at the supermarket where Dylan and Ruby are stacking the shelves for tomorrow's shoppers. And he brings Loogie the eggs and flour he needs to make his cakes, bread, and buns. Loogie bakes at night so his pastry can be fresh and warm for people breakfast. Johnny, Dot, and Isaac work on the train tracks. They have to work fast to make sure the tracks is cleared before the first train leaves in the morning. Dana and Todd are paramedics. They take people to the hospital quickly in the ambulance. Doctors and nurses like Gurnma and Sayan will take care of people there. In other parts of the hospital, babies are born. Fonda is a midwife. She helps welcome them safely into the world. Babies don't sleep through the night right away, so new parents work hard at night too. When I'm sleeping, so many important jobs are being done, like my mom with her, her big orange bus, she gets everybody just where they need to be. And when the night work is done and the sun comes up again, my mom drives. Home, where it's our turn for breakfast and mom turn to go to bed. Thank you, mom, and thank you to everyone who works all through the night. Yeah, I want to. Yeah, I always say thank you to the people that do work at night to keep us going and make sure you know the store shelves are stocked and everything else, and that there's fresh donuts for people to enjoy and everything, and to our paramedics and to our police officers that work at night to deal with the crazies. <laughs> well, everybody, hope all of you enjoyed this book reading. And if you did, can you give it a big thumbs up? Smash that thumbs up button. Can you do that? 
And if you're new and you came along this book reading, can you hit that red subscribe button down below and subscribe to my channel and check out my other book readings. But until my next book reading, they call me Mr. Bookman. And this book reading is over. Have a good one, everybody. And take care. And have a good one.